I'm so pretty. Did you really just say that? Jesus Christ, get the fuck over yourself. Morning, students. I'm your new English teacher, John Michael McNeely. I'm going to be taking over your class for the rest of the year. Now, you can call me Mr. Mac, you can call me Mr. M, you can call me John, you can call me Michael, you can call me John Michael. Just do me a favor and don't call me... Mr. McNeely? <sighs> yes? Uh, what, what happened to Mrs. Montalban? Well, the school wants me to tell you that she's on vacation. But since we're all friends here, she was murdered on a weekend trip to Mexico and her body was found at the border stuffed full of mescaline. Now, who's ready to get this party started? Please stop trying to relate to us, you stupid fuck. All right. Well, why don't we all learn each other's names with a little bit of roll call? Deandra, how do you pronounce this last name? Uh, don't worry about it. I'm here. Trisha Capoletti. Oh, somebody's family's from Italy. Oh, no. We actually live off of uh, Vista Heights. It's a cul-de-sac, but I'm here. Uh-oh. Looks like we've got ourselves a little late Lucy. <laughs> little joke, guys. Little joke. I, you know, I'd like to have fun. Uh, yeah. Sorry I'm late. Uh, hell no, this bitch did not just walk into this classroom. Oh, hell no. All right, what's your name? Uh, Ashley Catchadorian. Okay, Ashley Catchadorian, let's not make it a habit. Have a seat. Ashley, what the fuck do you think you're doing walking back into this school? Uh, listen, guys, I'm sure you're probably still pretty heated. Uh, heated? <laughs> Ashley, do you know where I'm going to put this shoe? Uh, um... I'm guessing pro probably in my asshole. Ashley, catch it. Look, guys, I tried to transfer to Atchison, but my mom wouldn't make the commute. Turns out it's a lot further away than I thought. Yeah, it's north of Topeka. West of the 71. Everybody knows that. Oh. Wait, who the fuck is this? <laughs> Ashley, catch a Dorian. She betrayed us at cheer nationals. You found her spot on the cheer squad? Also, you threw me into a fountain. You told me about her the first day we met? Yeah, but that's not Ashley Katsudorian. A late Linda as well. That's Ashley Katsudorian. Oh, I thought we already had an Ashley Katsudorian. So sorry about the confusion. I'm Jenna Darabond. Oh, Darabond, of course. Please, have a seat. You know what, guys? It seems like everybody's here, so today I thought we'd watch a little video. Yay! Woo! Yeah. All about me! Fuck. What up, Overland Park? I'm Mr. Mac, your new English and theater t- uh, uh, Get me out of this box! <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm kidding. I know, it's a TV. I wish I could see your faces. <laughs> Trust me, they're priceless. I hope I'm watching. You are. Where the fuck have you been? You are way behind on your paperwork. <laughs> do you have any fucking clue what the fuck has been going on around here? Oh yes, Brittany, I do. In fact, I have a better idea of what's been going on around here than any of you ever will. <laughs> what the fuck is that supposed to mean? And why the fuck does Deandra think that you're Ashley Katadorian? Yeah. Why the fuck do I think you're Ashley Katadorian? Well, you see, this all started a long time ago. I don't know, Mackenzie. I just, I feel bad. I mean, I can't help but feel like Justin Michelson and I are meant to be together. Yeah, but he's dating Ashley Katadorian. No, I know, and that's why I feel so bad. Well, if you ask me, any cheerleader who hooks up with another cheerleader's boyfriend is a whore. But not just any kind of whore, the worst kind of whore. Like the whore the pimp uses to collect the money. I took your advice. I tried to do nothing. Tried to forget about Justin Michelson. Tried to forget about stealing him away from Ashley Kachadorian. Uh, I'm gonna be going to Pearl Harbor for a few weeks. Would you mind giving Trisha my paperwork? Oh yeah, no problem, Ashley. Thanks. You're a really good friend. <gasps> Here I was, trying to be the bigger person. And there you were, being, well, the degenerate trash bag slut that you've always been. Hey, Jenna. Our little secret. Kay? Thanks. 
It was at that moment that I realized that in this cheer squad, your cheer squad, nothing was sacred. So I might as well take what I want. And if someone like Ashley Cachadorian gets hurt in the process, so be it. Jesus, Jenna, when did you get so fucking dark? But you, Mackenzie, you weren't collateral damage. No, you needed to be taken down a peg. Several pegs, in fact. So I gave one of your old friends a call. Wait, what? Hold on. Okay, go ahead. Cheating on Stephen Carmichael? Oh no, thank you. But my real solution came in the form of a new girl. Yay, me with arms. Can I help you? Uh, yeah, I need to poop. Oh, well, this yeah, is... Yeah, I know, it's some kind of weird territorial cheerleader bullshit. But I have some actual bullshit that is about to become some hallway bullshit, so I don't really have time to deal with all of your autocratic bathroom hierarchy bullshit. Capiche? An aggressive, mysterious girl that held no respect for authority? She was everything that I needed, and all I needed to do was light the match. Excuse me, are you internal monologuing right now? Oh, right. By all means, please. Thank you, God. Oh, by the way, my name's Ashley. Ashley Kajadorian. Great. Fucking weirdo. What the fuck? Hey, guys, can we uh, keep it down in the back, please? This part is about to get really good. You were the one that let Deandra in? Oh. Wow. Oh. You were in charge of the... But you told her to... And you made out... There's a lot of things making sense now. Oh. Dots are being connected. <gasps> There's a... Oh. Hey, Ashley. Uh, wait, Mackenzie. You made out with Justin? Shut the fuck up, Ashley Kajadorian! Do you have any idea of the chain of events that your one act of insolence started? Oh, yes I do. Things got really complicated at prom when Brittany decided to put her dirty whore lips on my Justin just moments after giving a less than adequate hand job to Connor DeVarnon in the parking lot. Um, he seemed pretty satisfied when he drove away in my car. Just saying. Wait, are we just gonna skip over the part where everybody ripped my fucking arms off? Yeah, I didn't have anything to do with that. That was super fucked up. Thank you! After prom, even though Ashley Cachadorian was out of the picture, I still had to give Mackenzie and Brittany what they had coming to them. And Stubbs McGee wasn't gonna be enough. I had my arms ripped off. You're really gonna make fun of me too? So I thought to myself, what better way to take down a cheer squad than with another cheer squad? Okay, you guys, seriously. I'm really gonna need you to keep it down. If you don't pay attention, you're gonna miss my favorite quotes from There Will Be Blood. I've abandoned my boy! Wait, the Atchison Cheer Squad showed up because their mall burned down. <laughs> it's amazing how dangerous a Brookstone can be. You never know when someone might plug an electric blanket into the same outlet as a meditative rock fountain. Oh my god! You burned down their mall? We don't need no water, let the mother... <laughs> it's funny, guys, but come on now, we're almost to the end. Actually, Mr. McNeely, I think we should probably be paying attention to what's being said back here. Because it sounds like someone's confessing to several very serious felonies. So what you're telling me is the shitstorm that has been our lives is all because of you? Oh, Mackenzie. The shitstorm is only just beginning. Hey guys, thanks for watching this episode. Huge thanks to our special guest, Tyler Oakley. Make yeah. sure that you subscribe to his channel, click the button right underneath here. If you guys like Tyler and you like this video, make sure you click like. And make sure you subscribe to our channel. Click the button right here. And we'll see you next week. Tyler will be back with us. This is Mr. McNeely again. What's gonna happen? Jenna Darrow, Bob McKenzie, Tails, all that stuff will happen. Ah! Alright, I'm gonna press record now. I'm just kidding. <laughs>